Baltimore told you? Um, God bless you. It's caught me a little off guard, Bishop. A, a, a couple of, uh, what was it, three or four days ago? Three or four days ago, I, I called. I was at Manpower. And um, being blessed. Wrote my check out. I said, you know, I, I, I didn't have my checkbook when I got to Pastor White's. Uh, when I got to a uh, uh, woman that I lose the night before and Pastor White said, you know, write a check for $113,000 for those of you who can. Write a, write a check for $113 for Psalms 113. And I wrote a check for $113,000. And I admit, <clears throat> my intention was to just leave the check and bless God. Because, see, I love to give. I've been a giver all my life. And when people have given to you and sown into you and God has touched them and given, given you favor. Because, see, when you have favor with, come on, somebody. <clears throat> See, they don't understand it where I come from. They don't understand it in Hollywood. But I'm going to tell you something about the blood of Jesus. All of my life, you know, my mother, she didn't have much to give me. She didn't have millions of dollars. She didn't have some legacy, but she had Jesus. And she taught me about that God. So I didn't even know that he was he was trying to build this youth center. I didn't even know it, but I know how important the youth are. So we were sitting in the service, and I leaned up toward him, and I said, I've just been touched to give a million dollars. So as... So when you got up here and you said a million dollars, I said, God, I don't know what you're doing, but I know I heard your voice. I'm going to tell you right now when you hear the voice of God you move don't worry about what nobody says to you don't worry about what it looks like don't worry about your enemy don't worry about your hater he will bless you he will lift you he will give Sometimes you spend too much time worried about your haters. You spend too much time worried about people talking about you. But what you need to understand is that the Bible says in order for you to be blessed, your haters have to be present. How do I know that? The book of Psalms says he prepares a table before me in the presence of my enemies. So in order for me to eat, they have to be present. So God bless you, Bishop. I pray right now that you will continue to do everything you're doing. I pray his anointing will stay upon you. I pray the power of God all over you. I pray his favor. I pray the blood of Jesus will come upon you right now. Keep you in his hair. God, I thank you for your blessings. Praise Him! Praise Him! Praise Him! 